from Srebrenica. I am coach almost 20 years. I was working in a lot of European teams. I was working in Serbia, in Greece, Poland, Belgium, Poland, Cyprus, China, Hungary. I was the coach of national team of Serbia, ex Yugoslavia, six years. We won two times European Championship in uh, Roma and in Athena. I was in that time I was assistant coach. And I was head coach uh, of the national team under 22. We won a bronze medal in Istanbul, 1996. Yeah. Uh, you are the only man, you know, after over a century who held the Iranian team and who coached the Iranian team to the Olympic Games. It was, uh, we can just say that it was about, uh, you know, a century that Iran never, uh, was never able to go to the Olympic. And you did uh, this job for the Iranian team. What was the secret behind and, you know, what was the, uh, what did you exactly do with the Iranian team that they could do this we cannot talk about secret, we can talk about the hard work. You know, we were preparing for the Japan almost four months. I think nobody was preparing like our team. We make a good atmosphere in the team and we make a good uh, uh, chemistry in the team. Uh -huh. That was our biggest, biggest point. Also, I was asking the discipline in the court, out of the court, and uh, I think that we improve, the national team of Iran improved tactically. And mm -hmm. this is the reason, all these things, what I said, uh, are the reason why we won uh, the championship in Japan. Nobody before, the, the, before Japan believed in us, because uh, we stay without some, let's say, key players from the past. Sama Vesi, Alireza Honardos, uh, Iman Zandi, Tajik Puya, Nejad Sarab, and uh, we have a lot of young players like, uh, and the new players like Oshin, like Akberi, like uh, Javad Davari, uh, and uh, nobody expected uh, from us that we can do that, but I said we have nice atmosphere, we have a good chemistry, we have a spirit in the team, we show the character, uh, our players were warriors, and in the end uh, we made the greatest result in the history of Iranian basketball. What was your uh, impression at the moment that the Iranian team won the, the game against Lebanon and finally they qualified? Well, my, I was very tired because four months we were working, you know, and it was a lot of uh, mentally stressed during all these things. Uh, I think during the four months, every day we improve ourselves, we improve the team, and it was a very tough time, and I was emotionally empty in that time. But after five or ten minutes after the game, I feel uh, very proud of the players because uh, they they were sacrificing for the team and they deserve a lot of glories in this time. Mm -hmm. And uh, what do you think uh, about Iran being in the Olympic? What kind of you know, uh, status do you believe that Iran will achieve in the Olympic? You know, our, I said uh, we are winners, you know, anyway. You know, we, we were on a 51st place in the ranking in the world before Japan. After Japan, we were on a 32nd place, you know, and we were jumping in the first 12, 12 teams. Mm -hmm. uh, we are winners anyway. If we lost all the games in, in uh, Beijing, we are winners. If we show the character, we are winners. If we, show, uh, if we show that we are warriors, we are winners. If we win one game, we are great winners, mm -hmm. you know. If we, if, if we won, if we will win two games, we are heroes, you know, and that's, that's the point. We cannot lose anything because now we start to be a respectable uh, basketball country in the world. We have a lot of invitation for the tournaments. We are, we are really winners and uh, uh, that's, that's the most important thing in this moment. Yeah. And the last question is, what do you think about the Iranian basketball uh, you know, in Asia and generally in the world? I think that Iranian basketball have a great potential, mm -hmm. you know, that's, 
uh, uh, with their athletic possibilities. You know, they you can compare them with uh, with all the all the players in maybe in the world. You know, only what they need is to pick up some tactical thing because I think that European players are better tactically than than uh, than our players. Mm -hmm. But if you send in the future few our guys to Europe to pick up the the way of practicing, the way of uh, behavior, and uh, to play tough tactical games, I think that Iranian basketball can can stay in the top in Asia next 10 years. Thank you so much, Mr. Truman. Thank you.